Hello everybody, welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks, Diecast Restorations. So, this project, uh, I'm going to take on this Highway Patrol van. Uh, I'm going to do the same black and white colors, but uh, it's missing a door. And I'm going to try my luck at making a door. Uh, I'm going to have to go on to Google and see what kind of door this originally had. So, and also, this is from a company I've never heard of. I need to do some research. So, let's see here. So, it looks like Zilmax. So, I need to see what that company's made of and see what they uh, what they produced. So anyway, this is just a highway patrol van and a very plain vehicle, very plain interior. For some reason, no detail. So I'm going to be painting that. So anyway, all right. Stay tuned. Take this uh, Zilmax apart. All right. So let's see what we've got for the old Ford van here. It's actually a pretty cool casting. I did a little research on Zilmex. And, uh, yeah, they produced die-cast toys. I don't think that they were very popular. And if anybody has any more knowledge on them, uh, let me know. So, okay, so here we go. Very plain interior. Missing a door. So, uh, Juan over at Matchbox Resurrection uh, did a door, I believe, for a majorette ambulance, man, and he killed it. So, I'm going to try to uh, do what he did. He just used a paper clip, but man, he makes it look so easy. All right. So let's see what we got going on here. Well, there we go. Tab on the base. I'm going to keep the wheels. Um, just because it's going to be too hard. These are really tiny wheels. And I, and I don't really want to do any major work on the casting. And let's see what we got for the interior. All right. So I would say, uh, this is about as boring as you can be. So I'm going to try to jazz it up if I can. And let's see here. There we go. There's the window unit. Not too bad. And I do have a little beacon here. Which it looks like. I don't know how it comes out. Let me get it on the camera so you can see. So it looks like it might just pop out. Let's see here. Here we go. And I'll probably just glue it back in. So here we go. There's the body. The body. Interior. Boring. Window unit. Chassis and beacon. That's it. And I need to fabricate a door. So stay tuned. All right. So here's the Ford Transit or cop van, I guess. It's weird because when I took out the interior, it's got a refrigerator, sink, and everything. And so, yeah, kind of interesting how they would make this a uh, kind of an RV type. I guess if they're pulling over uh, like drunk drivers or something or maybe criminals, they can just go back there and wash their hands and maybe make some microwave popcorn or something. I don't know. Anyway, so here's the door that I made. It is obviously a non-working door because I'm not skilled enough to make a door to open. And when I went on the original uh, photo of this, Looks like it had a roll-up door. So anyway, I'm not too sure why my camera is not focusing. There we go. All right, so I'll put a coat of primer on this and see what we've got. Stay tuned. 
All right, so here's the van all primed up. And there's my makeshift door. All right, I'm going to put a coat of paint on this and see what we've got. Stay tuned. All right, it is time for the uh, all the pieces to my little custom Ford police van. So let's start off with the wheels. Same wheels. I'm not going to do a wheel swap because these wheels are pretty tiny. Take from out the uh, rims. Uh, window unit. The main body here. And <clears throat> I live in Maricopa County. Uh, which is Phoenix, basically. And there's the sheriff badge. And then on the back... I did my uh, my door, but obviously it's not workable. And then I did my little window unit with the mesh right there. And I'm not a big fan of the stencils with the white backing. It looks kind of tacky, but it wouldn't show up on the, the, the clear ones wouldn't show up on the paint, <clears throat> the chassis. And... I went ahead and detailed the interior because it was pretty plain before. So I painted the seats black and spray painted it gray. And I did the two sinks. And then that big closet unit. I'm assuming it's not a refrigerator. It's probably a closet unit. So this could be like a little, I don't know, crime lab van or something. I don't know. And then uh, there's the front end. And then there's a little beacon. All right, let me put this together and do the reveal. Stay tuned. All right, it is time for the final reveal for my little Ford van here. So it all went together pretty good. <clears throat> so like I said in the uh, previous clip, got the new decals and painted it the colors of the Sheriff Department here in Maricopa County, uh, black and gold. And did the interior really can't see it but I know it's there and that's about it so I've got a I've got a matchbox uh, super fast uh, bus that I'm doing next and that'll be up uh, tomorrow and that's part two of the build so anyway if you like this video hit the like button subscribe all that good jazz and stay safe and I'll see you in the next one